hi dear Aquarius a very very good evening to you guys this is Anjali Tarot and this is a journal of reading for all the Aquarius Sun Moon Venus rising keep in mind this is general it might or might not resonate with you at the first place the second thing this uh, the roles can be reversed also the feelings and action can be from your side also and uh, let's start okay this is a reading from today till the next 72 hours if uh, it's not resonating with you it's not your story please uh, don't try to fit yourself forcible into this Let's start your person's current feelings for you right now are Aquarius at this current moment, present moment. We can say we have the Ten of Pentacles, the Hermit and the Two of Wands. Bottom of the deck is the Temperance. So somebody feels like uh, losing patience is not going to work out in this situation. They have to be very, very patient if they, uh, if they have to get you back or if they feel like they should have something solid and committed with you. So this person definitely feels like they have to wait and they have to be very patient and they don't, don't have to lose their temper. Okay, might be this person is trying to come back to your life again and again and rushing towards you doing something stupid again and again. This time they feel like patience is the virtue. Okay, so you could be dealing with the Sagittarius here. This person is feeling uh, definitely feeling like you guys have a potential to stay together or to have a long term partnership commitment and or marriage kind of energy. But they feel like the timing is not right for both of you. The timing is kind of off right now and they have to wait for the right timing. This person definitely sees you in their future. They definitely feels like, okay, you are the one who can be their potential partner, potential spouse. But they simultaneously, they feel like there's something that you you guys need to resolve in this situation to, be, to make this situation work out for you for the long term. In some cases, it might also be possible that either you or the person that you're connected to, they're married or uh, to someone else. That is why you guys are waiting for this marriage or for this situation to go you know um, to resolve so that you guys can connect with each other or one of you is committed to someone else might be might be i'm just uh, telling you the scenarios all the scenarios but this person is definitely feeling uh, like they can see you in their future and they feel a committed kind of relationship with you okay they see the potential in this situation or relationship whatever you have uh, right now so you could be dealing with aries Leo, sagittarius or virgo or taurus virgo capricorn or sagittarius even if you are not just go with the energies, not with the science only. Let's see what this person wants from you. What are their intentions for the situation? <coughs> we got the ten of wands, the three of pentacles in reverse and seven of cups in reverse. Five of cups. This person wants to come out of this sad and depressing kind of energy of loneliness and uh, not able to connect with you uh, on that level that they should. Right? This person wants some kind of companionship back in the situation, some kind of uh, beautiful, beautiful kind of, uh, you know, uh, emotions back in the situation. Somebody is feeling left out in the situation. Deep, deep uh, regrets are there, deep uh, uh, emotional kind of wounded kind of energies there and they want to heal the situation. This person doesn't want to uh, like uh, have any kind of stressful kind of situation or relationship between you and them. They don't want any kind of confused energy, any kind of third party, any kind of issues between you guys. So simply this person wants to heal the situation between you and them and make things, uh, make things uh, correct between you and them and then only they want to proceed further. Somebody doesn't want to like uh, uh, operate on any kind of confusion or operate in a situation where there is a third party kind of situation. Okay, and uh, there is if there is stressful kind of energies between you guys, this person doesn't want to operate in this kind of energy. They want to give it time and space and a lot of uh, uh, positive vibe and positive energy that in the future might be we guys can be together and works things out, and work things out. Okay, works things out, work thing out, work works thing, work things out. Oh my god, <laughs> shit. Cool. Let's see uh, what action is this person going to take towards you, if any, in the next 72 hours or 4 to 5 days. <coughs> we got the Knight of Swords, the Lovers and the Death card and Rebirth. Mm, the Fool card. Somebody is going to come towards you, okay? It's like somebody suddenly, uh, unexpectedly, out of the blue, you can expect somebody coming towards you with this energy of, okay, I have uh, uh, put an end to a third party situation between me and uh, someone else and uh, I am ready to be with you now. So it could be you, it could be them. Uh, there is a need of, uh, you know, ending something with someone to be with each other in this situation. 
or ending some kind of situation where both of you are not able to connect with each other whatever the case may be one of you is going towards the another person with this energy of okay i don't have any kind of relationship or situation with anyone else now and i want to be with you and it is going to be so sudden and unexpected that uh, it might shock you or it might shock the other person but somebody needs to end something with someone or somebody needs to some kind of issues in the situation before they can come back to you and you can expect somebody coming towards you rushing towards you or chasing you after ending something or someone some like some kind of relationship with someone else but i do see a brand new beginning happening in the situation and action being taken from this person side so you could be dealing with a scorpio gemini gemini libra aquarius cancer pisces scorpio taurus virgo capricorn uh even if you are not just go with the energies not with the signs only let's see what is the guidance for you people in this situation aquarius we got the eight of swords the star card and the chariot hmm okay so if you are constantly overthinking like when it is going to be healed when it is going to be healed when i am going to have a positive relationship in my life when i am going to have this thing in my life when i will be able to get out of this uh, a mental jail kind of situation uh, okay the moment you will start moving ahead the moment you will start releasing this energy and trying to understand what is triggering these kind of feelings and emotions in uh, inside of you you need to understand what is that one thing that's triggering you again and again and uh, you are uh, like uh, going in circles again and again in your life once you will be able to break that circle okay and once you will be able to move on and this time you will be in this energy of okay no matter what i'm very determined not to go back to the same kind of foolish kind of energies or going around in circle and cir circle and circles and uh, not going anywhere not reaching anywhere you have to point out what is that one thing that's stopping you from getting what you really want in your life okay you need to trigger like find out the trigger point for yourself and you need to be your own therapist as of now right now uh, aquarius and once you will be able to trigger like find that trigger point you will uh, have to be very you have to be very determined and you have to be very much in this energy of no matter what i'm now never going to do this uh, again this thing again or i'm never going to repeat the same cycle again then it will start happening like it will start healing and you will start getting results as per what you really want in your life it all starts uh, from you and it all ends with you so you have to be responsible for these situations and you have to be responsible for creating the positive things in your life and it will start happening yep so thank you so much for tuning in aquarius i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste